All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. I'm about to sneeze. False alarm. Welcome back. We're playing some Mario Kart 64. I'm playing this through the Nintendo Switch Online pack or whatever they call it. This is actually my first time experiencing this. My first time ever buying the Nintendo Switch Online pack or whatever. Basically, it gives you like uh, the option to play a bunch of other Nintendo 64 games and a bunch of other classic games and stuff. So yeah, here we go. Here's the full catalog of Nintendo 64 classics that we can go back and play. Uh, obviously, we're playing Mario Kart today. We're starting a new series. Just like I did with Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, we'll be doing this. I'm not sure if Mario Kart Double Dash is on here for the GameCube or the GameCube Online Pack, whatever they call it there. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, now, I did tell you guys I was going to play this on the original hardware, which I do still have. I still have my copy of Mario Kart 64. Yes, I know, it's not like in perfect condition, but I still have it. And it sounds like a maraca. And I still have my Nintendo 64 from my childhood. So, I was going to play them through this, like the original hardware and the original... I guess brick <laughs> so uh, I mean but then again I kind of like thought like I don't feel like connecting plugging in a bunch of stuff if you guys make content on YouTube you guys already know how much a pain in the ass it is to get all this crap you know situated and you know ready and stuff so I'm not gonna be doing that I'd rather just play it through here it's already through the uh, modern console Hopefully this game doesn't lag or stutter or anything like that. I'm not sure if there's any like uh, different um, resolutions or frame rate on this. I doubt it, but anyways, let's not waste any more time. Let's get straight into it. One player game. I'm going to be playing this through 100cc on Mario Kart 8 was really easy. Should we try it again on 100cc? Dude, I can't even talk. I'm so excited. We'll just do 50 cc, all right? And uh, we're gonna be using basically the same thing that we did last time. We're gonna be using different characters. We're gonna be starting with Mario. Perfect. And uh, wow, holy crap. I forgot there's only like four cups here. So it's gonna be a really short series. But it is what it is. Here we go, guys. Mushroom Cup, Luigi the Raceway, Moo Moo Farm, Koopa Troopa Beach, and Calamari Desert. Here we go. Um, you guys already know, I've talked about this before on the channel, but uh, this game was basically like a play. Oh my gosh. Basically this game, my uh, cousins and I would always play this game around my birthdays and every time they would always come over. Uh, so, uh, excuse me, I'm not like really good at drifting in this game. And... Um, like I said, it's been a long time since I played this game, uh, traditionally, so it's going to be an experience for all of us, and uh, oh yeah, I forgot about that little monitor there, that was freaking ahead of its time back in the day. Alright, so my controls are, alright, so this is to get wrecked Toad, get wrecked Donkey Kong, I'm in first place, alright. What else? Alright, that's to throw. Alright, cool. Oh. I was trying to get that um, hot air balloon. It's alright. Alright. So, people are trying to get me. Um. Holy crap. Oh, I thought I was going to get... Who's... Donkey Kong's right behind me. Also, in this game, when you get hit by the freaking blue shell, dude, you go fucking flying. Like, they don't play around with that. And yeah, in the other games, it kind of like twirls around you, strips in front of you, and then it hits you. But in this one, it's a little bit more different. It's like on the... It's on the ground. There we go. Ooh, I got I got a what's his name? 
I got DK with the banana. Damn, that's that is a uh, very stereotypical. Oh, never mind. No, I got someone else. He's right behind me. Got him. <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna get the double on him. Looks like Toad and Donkey Kong are gonna be fighting for a uh, second place there. And uh, ooh, I won. I am surprised I won that. These older games are a little bit more, a uh, little bit more tricky. Uh, I don't know. They, they, just, they just don't make them like they used to anymore. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that. Damn, so many memories, man. That's crazy. Ah, oh, man. I wish I could, like, just... I wish I could go back and uh, play this game with my younger self. And beat the shit out of him in this game. There we go. We finally got the freaking boost there at the beginning. It's a little bit more tricky. If only I could tell him, like, yo, they don't make them like they used to anymore, man. Trust me. But you will have fun with the Mario Kart DS, I'll tell you that. Alright, Donkey Kong's, like, right on my ass. Oh, shit. There we go. Yeah, in this game, they're a little bit more, uh, oh, fuck you. You piece of fuck. Alright, oh, my gosh. Not the whole squad on me. I got Peach right behind me. Where in the hell's Toad? Nah, nah, fam. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. What the hell? Freaking turtle just, like, decided to end himself. Ooh, got him. Yeah, you see, like, they're, like, literally right behind you in this game. And if it was, like, Mario Kart... Oh, fuck me. If it was, like, Mario Kart uh, DS or... Any other game, they kind of like, they're a little bit more easier on you, I guess, in a way. But yeah, these guys are literally on my tail. And we're playing freaking 50cc, so goes to show. Got him. Oh, fuck you. Damn it. Oh, this is the last lap as well. I gotta get my shit together. Come on. Also, I really hope the audio is not loud. Where it gets picked up by the algorithm. Or else I'll really suck. Ooh, I got him at the last second. No way. I just made a DK lose its uh, lead. You guys are wondering. I, I, think I don't think I mentioned how much the uh, pack was. But it was 53 or so with taxes. And you guys already know I'm like really, really cheap. I don't really like spending much money. So I'm going to try to make this, uh, I guess, year. I think I bought the one year pack or whatever. I don't really know, but I'm going to have to make it worth it. <laughs> Damn, I feel like blowing my nose. Would you guys mind if I blow my nose real quick? Hate to pause it there. I'll be right back. Uh, I'm just going to go off to the side right here. Alright. Let me go wash my hands. I'll be right back. Probably never seen that before in a video. All right, cool. We're back. All right, so this is Koopa Troopa Beach. Get out of here, Toad. Get wrecked, son. All right. I know there's a shortcut right here. No, the high tide. Fuck me. There we go. Also, there's another shortcut with a ramp. Here it is. I don't think I can make it, though. Uh, 
Oh, crap. Oh, the crabs. The crabs, get the fuck. Oh, my goodness. Oh, almost got him with that ricochet there. Yeah, I'm telling you, man, in this game, they're a little bit more, a little bit more brutal. The NPCs are actually really smart. They don't make them like they used to anymore, huh? I always use the banana for uh, speed. There we go. No. No, Toad. Get away. Get away, Toad. Get away. Get away, buddy. Get away. Oh, shoot. Alright, final lap. You got this. Damn, he's literally on my tail, though. Got him. <laughs> Body. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, wow. This game's already rigged. Never mind. It's like every other modern game where it just fucks you over. Wouldn't this game be considered modern? I mean, we're talking about, like, the late 90s, but... It's, uh... Damn, it's actually before my time, though, by two years. Got him. I was born two years later when this shit released. Oh, uh, fuck. No! No! No, I lost... Oh, well. <laughs> Freaking crab, bro. Freaking Mr. Crab's greedy motherfucker got in the way, dude. That's bullshit. Damn, dude. I was going for, like on a clean streak. That sucks. The controls are really weird. It has like every other same control except I'm using X on my pro controller to throw stuff. So I'm like kind of holding on to that while doing everything else. It's kind of weird. But that's just excuses, though. I mean, we already won the. It is what it is. Alright, so this is the Calamari Desert I remember. Not the one from the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. That shit was trash in a bag. That shit was dog shit. This is the one I remember from my childhood. This is how I remember it. This is how it looks to me in my eyes. It does, it does not look like that piece of crap that we played. That was ass. I like how everyone just waits for the train. They don't do that little detail anymore. I was using this banana for protection. You guys noticed the freaking uh, blue shells that hit me yet? I mean, this game's a little bit more rare. It doesn't happen like every other fucking second. That shit gets annoying. Like I said, like, I don't mind a freaking blue shell, but like when it happens like every other damn lap or so, it gets really annoying. Alright, so I left them behind. Oh, never mind. They just caught up. You know, at least I can appreciate that I'm, like, battling, like, second and third place in this game. Because in the other one, dude, I'd be so far ahead. Like, it's not even even competition. So, I, I, you know what? At least I can appreciate that there's people literally behind me trying to fight for first place. Makes the game more believable. And also, it makes the gameplay a lot better. And if anything, it makes me a better player, so... I can always uh, commend that. That's good. Because right now, dude, if I was, like, on Mario Kart freaking 8... I'd be so far ahead, dude. There'd be no point. Ooh, dude, look how close they were. Look at second and third place. Look how close they were. Like, that's like, you just don't see that anymore. 
We were literally all fighting for like <clears throat> first place there. No matter though, we already won. And um, yeah, that's uh, already the first episode down. Uh, three more to go. <laughs> I mean. Damn. I remember they pull up like that. I believe they used the same. Oh yeah, look at the fourth place over there. You guys see Wario there in the back? And I think the uh, that one dude decides to nut all over us. Yeah, there we go. There comes the fish to blow us off. And, uh, kind of spits out the cum as a trophy. And, uh, it comes down like that. That's crazy, bro. <sighs> so many memories. Anyways, folks, I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. And, um, yeah. Later.